Welcome back to the Republic News Channel. I am uh, your current host today, Senator Tykes, and uh, I'm coming to you today with some urgent news. Uh, we got some new headlines that are saying the Jedi have turned against the Senate. Uh, I'm joined here today with my good friend, Senator Askak, and uh, I believe he is an eyewitness to these accounts and is here to give us uh, his side of the story. So, uh, with any ado, can I get a round of applause for my friend Askak? Yeah. 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 I love you, Askak. You like my dad, bro? Space cow. Whoops. Alrighty. Askak, so what happened today, buddy? Right. Being a witness to what went down, after I heard that you were being attacked by Doom's unit and the 212th, my heart reached out to you, and I thought this is a matter that we need to take care of immediately. And so we decided to usher you to the Jedi Temple where us other senators were residing, and as we entered into the Holocron Vault, they denied us entry and told us we cannot stay there for we are not allowed a safe space because we are simply senators. And when we tried to also enter the council room, which is even more safe, they denied us again and then asked us to leave. Can you believe that? Us senators of the Republic literally told to go out into the battlefield and die for what purpose yes yes i, I, I know come. i believe i was mm -hmm. being hunted by uh by a few dooms unit audience what do you guys think can we get a can we get a call i think that's Does bullshit want to call it? Boo. Stop the jedi. Boo. i love the jedi Boo. i wish Boo. there was a order where we could kill them all all right calm down calm down calm down all righty ask i could how did this make you feel personally Personally, I felt it really hurt. It really hurt me as a person because as Chief Voyager, I felt betrayed. I work with the 41st, 91st, RO, and Jedi on a daily basis, and the fact that the Jedi did this to us, despite all the hospitality we gave them, it just really makes me feel down. I don't know how to feel right now. Yeah, Saskak, I'm, I'm pretty sure when the when the temple needed new renovations, you were one of the first ones to uh, come to their aid. So, uh, just a shame. Uh, what a shame, I'd say. Uh, so, you said you ran into uh, what? What kind of what reason were you told to leave? I apologize. We were told to leave simply because we entered an area we weren't supposed to. How are we supposed to know where to enter? It's not like they keep signs up for us. I mean, I thought the Jedi were okay with us just entering as we please, so long as we didn't touch anything. Ah, oh, yes, I understand. And uh, was there any allegations made towards the Senate afterwards? I believe uh, there was a few. They said that we decided to knock off some people of the Galactic Army of the Republic, which I think is pretty preposterous. And we also managed to steal a holocron. We are senators! We don't know how to open nor steal holocrons. Fuck it makes no sense. Oh. We're gonna go ahead and go to commercial. Uh, like our host the last time said, uh, Killer Game Star, uh, today's sponsor is going to be uh, Prime. Alright, drink Prime, stay hydrated. Use code TYKES, get 20% off, and, uh, yeah, we'll go back to our normal broadcast. Yes, Askak, uh, as you were stating, you said you were accused of stealing a holocron, correctly? Mm-hmm. You were accused of stealing a holocron. Interesting, and, and if, I'm not, if I'm not wrong, only the Jedi are able to open them, correct? Only Jedi are able to open said holocrons. Interesting, interesting. And and when when accused of this, did they ask to, you know to have a conversation with you before you left the temple? Did they you know search you before you left? Did they just leave you, let you go? What what happened afterwards? They just simply told us to leave the temple. So we decided to reside somewhere else. We decided to just build our hideout in a cave far away from them, along with Du and the two twelfth, because we didn't want to get attacked. Look at us. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, and during this time, uh, were there any, you know, allegations made towards you, slanderous sayings uh, during this this time where you were uh, on the run, I believe? No slander towards my name, but it appears that there was some slander towards you and Padme as they decided to apprehend Padme. Interesting. Padme who... Padme had nothing to do with this, I thought, I believe, right? Uh, why, would, why would they be... You know, why would they be 
making allegations towards her as she is a Sikh senator, you know, very much trusted by those in the Jedi Temple as well as the Galactic Republic. I believe that would be, you know, that, that's that's just crazy. That's preposterous. Blasphemy. Mary. All right. Well, then what what happened after that, Askak? After that situation, they decided to come down to our cave, which we had claimed for ourselves, and decided to attack us? I don't understand the reasoning behind it, but I will say I am so thankful for the fact that the office of the Supreme Chancellor, the Red Guards, came down to our aid and helped us, Senators, during this crisis. The fact that they were there, along with the 327th and SO, there to help us, I find it heartwarming. Interesting. Oh. Got a round, round of, of applause, applause to the Red Guard. Yeah. Woo, fuck yeah! Yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, represent. Shout out to the boys in red, man. Shout out to the boys in blue. As you see here, I'm guard guarded, I guess, by uh, Senate Commando right here to my right. Uh, that is purely because myself, Askak, and Padme do not, uh, do not feel safe anymore, uh, with the Jedi out and about, and as you may see, uh, there's a Jedi here in attendance with us today, so, you know, we're just having to keep things a little bit safer than normal. But, but as I was saying, as we were saying, uh, yes, Askak, so then, uh, after that moment, what happened, uh, what happened after that, bud? So, after we had been attacked... The Jedi decided to infiltrate by being cloaked. Very odd. They wanted to be cloaked, and then I assume they wanted to kidnap Padme in the midst of the battle. But luckily, our Red Guards were smarter than that, and they managed to halt that. And after that, we managed to escape out of the cave and come back to base where we are residing now. And, um, and was any holocron of any sort, was it a... a it found on anybody's person was did Padme have did I have it you know did you have anything? Oh, in fact the Jedi couldn't seem to identify who had the holocron because as we said we didn't have it we found it for them we misplaced it I guess we probably left it at the temple somewhere when we left because it's not ours it is not in our possession because we don't know how to open it what use do we have for it no sense Yes, I, I completely agree with you, dear friend. Well, um, as you heard it here first, uh, the Jedi are against the Senate. They believe us to be, uh, they believe us to be, uh, terrible people, honestly. Uh, I think it's sad. I think, you know, we do a lot for the Republic. And, uh, I know my friend here, Askak, does a lot for the Jedi, and it really just, it breaks my heart to see them, uh, you know, tear his name down like that. Alright, this has been your host, Senator Tykes. I am uh, here with my friend Askak, and we'll catch you at the next episode. Woo! Woo! Yeah! Woo! Bye -bye.